Howdy y'all, it's your host Rogue. Welcome back to Love Games. We're playing some more uh, Life is Strange 2. Your favorite character is Sean and Daniel Diaz. Well right now it's just Sean. We just busted out of a hospital. We drove into the Nevada desert trying to make our way to Haven Point to look for Daniel. Uh, we're in the middle of the desert. We're almost out of gas. We have uh, one missing eye. We're going to figure out what we can do. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and we're going to see what we can continue on in uh, this episode. So, let's continue. Start out by getting some sleep. He was smart driving a little off the road and hiding it behind a uh, rock. You're not going to get a super amount of driving with how little fuel you had. Still with me, Sean? <laughs> yeah. Just zoning out. Just don't do that when you're driving, my son. So, uh, what's the verdict on the new car? I know it's not a new board, but it's got four hot wheels. Thanks for finishing it, Dad. A perfect reward for your excellent report card. If only <laughs> you're dreaming. I'm proud, Sean. You don't even bullshit me when you need cash. Hey, I'll try to be cool. No dad jokes, huh? Oh no, I like the dad jokes. I hope Bring them on. Too bummed out to go on a big road trip with your lovely papito, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh please, you're the coolest dad. How could I be bummed? Excuse me. Because <laughs> he's dead. Where's my regular, emotionless son? <laughs> I appreciate it. Think we can hang out for five days without killing each other? Hell yeah. Haven't done that since I was a kid. Miss it. So do I. Been too long since we went padre hijo against the road. <sighs> Way too long. I love road trips. You're forgetting all about Daniel. Good to hear. <laughs> By the way, boy talk. What's going on with that gin, huh? <laughs> uh, well, not much to talk about. That was like pulling teeth. Well, I've got a week to find out the truth. It's over. Dude, go to the top. It's over. It's, uh... Over, Dad. Too much shit going on. It didn't work out. Ah. Oh. Hmm. She seemed like a nice girl. But I'm not worried about my handsome, shiny boy, huh? <laughs> ah. Could that be Daniel? Hola. Hello. Everything okay, Lila? Oh, Daniel better not be giving you any sass. <laughs> nah, he's an angel. We went to the swing pool, and now we're making popcorn for movie <laughs> night. Yes, it's so cool. Hey, Sean, don't crash the car. He's driving real <sighs> slow and safe, like a grandma. Thanks for checking in. <laughs> we'll buzz you when we hit the motel. Lila, you ready? Sounds good. And Sean, Jen wants you to call her. <laughs> Hmm. Doesn't sound like it's over for everyone here. Jeez. Uh, I don't know. Seriously, though. How are you really doing? It's too bit, but... I miss you. I miss you too, my son. 
But this is all part of growing up. Dealing with the I dead know. parents. The ghost of the past haunting you. I have total faith in you, Sean. You're a Diaz. You were born to roam and find your way home. God. I love you, Dad. If you would have came forward in Seattle, this would have been so much better. You showed me. You just broke out of the hospital. You blew up a weed farm. Hey, wake up. Huh? Huh? What? Yeah, what the fuck are you doing on our property? Huh? Oh, man, I crashed hard. Oh, yeah? Come on out, boy. Who the fuck is that? A fucking kid. Get out. Look, I'm leaving, okay? Uh, no you ain't. Step out, or I'll call the cops. You don't want that, boy. Okay, we're leaving now. No need to. I I'm leaving. Now. You deaf? I said, out. We don't need cops to deal with assholes like you anyway. Listen, I don't want any trouble. Too late for that, boy. So tell us what the fuck you're doing on our land. Yeah. I needed some rest. I drove for so long, I I had to pull over to get some rest, you know? I swear, I had no idea this was your property. There's a fucking sign. Didn't you see it? I was too exhausted. I guess I missed it. He only has one eye. He's just a kid, and he's hurt. Look. Yeah? What happened to your eye? I... got into an accident. Oh, yeah? Uh-huh. Move it. <sighs> Please. I just want to go. Ho-ho. <laughs> What's this? Drugs? Yeah, for my eye. Oh, yeah. Did you steal them? Like this car? Well, I lost my keys, and my friend helped me start it. You mean you hotwired it? Holy cow, fucking car thief, too. Take his backpack. Dude, come on. Get it. Let's see okay. what he's holding. Racist dude. He's only doing it because he's Hispanic. So? Nothing good. Any money? Fucking toys, man. You still play with toys? Seriously? It belongs to my brother. Leave it alone. There's no reason to fight for it. You're oh, already hurt. Your brother? Where is he now? Well, I'm going to meet him. In a stolen car? More lies. <sighs> okay, Chad. We fucked with him. Hey. Let him go. He's got Hold on nothing. a sec, Mike. You speak Spanish, Pedro? Huh? Oh, geez, racist. What? 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 Hablas Espanol. Chad. So, Professor, how do you say, I'm a dirty thief? Oh, geez, racist. Do oh, you don't want to share your language? <laughs> okay. Maybe you know this one. Uh. I'm a dirty thief with one eye. <laughs> no. No. Just stop, please. Figures. You come here to steal, but don't want to give back. All I want to do is learn Espanol. Might be our official language someday, right? See, si, senor? So, one more lesson. How do you say, this is not my country? It is his country. It's where he was born. I don't know. Told you. Well, that's the only one you should know, boy. Learn it. Look, Chad, it's gonna rain. Let's go before we get soaked. Hold on. 
This little thief is fucking with me. You're really pissing me off, you know that? But I'm willing to give you one last chance to make things right. Sing something. What? Just pass the audition and you're free. We'll be very upset if you refuse. He's gonna fuck himself. No. Really? Okay. I warned you, boy. Stop! Stop it, Chad! What the fuck, man? That's when you beat the shit out of your friend Chad and leave him in the desert. No place in the world for racism. That's why I left Nevada. What are you doing? Listen, you little beaner. Get your shit and go. Now. Look, just drive straight and you'll hit the highway. Forget this happened, man. Okay? You should totally just ram their truck. Shouldn't have pilled out like that. Ah, uh, reminds me of Las Vegas. So the the Wolf Brothers were split apart. The oldest wolf was badly hurt, but nothing could stop the wolf from following his brother's tracks. You're so gonna die in the desert the way you are. That's what you want to travel at night in. Try to take shelter during the day. It does get cold, but it's easier to keep warmth than to sweat out everything you have when you have no clothes to hide yourself. So, uh... Okay. Still a few hours away from Haven Point. Almost there. We need shade. Yeah, many, many years ago, I lived in shade Las Vegas. Break. When I lived in Vegas... I some shade at the next billboard. Literally everywhere I went was racism against anyone Hispanic. I hated it. So many people treated him. Stop. Can't run for miles in this heat. You did anyone of Hispanic descent just like utter crap. And I cannot stand that. Everyone's different. Everyone comes from different lineages. Love your fellow man. Shade. Yes. Shade. Oh, man. That's where you need to relax. You're killing me. Feels like hiking in hell. Never drew a desert before. 
Time to. Huh. It's so empty and quiet. Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw now. Okay, just draw now. Don't think about any this place is so empty. Dude, you need huh. some water. At least I won't mess up perspective for once. <laughs> I guess that's an okay start. But I can keep going. Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw now. His draw line is really good. He keeps okay. up the practice like he is. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. I could try adding details. Focus a bit more. Got a good picture of it. He kept I'm practicing. Man. He could actually make a I art form out of it. Focus for too long. Yeah, you need to drink some water. <sighs> Shit. My throat feels like sand. <sighs> yeah, that's one thing about Vegas. Not everyone's that way. I never like to say everyone's anyway, but I ran into a lot of racism there. And the schools and all the businesses, it really sucked. Love your fellow man, or woman, doesn't matter. No matter race, creed, religion. Everyone has it rough in one way or another. We don't know each other's battles. I don't really want to run because it's gonna end up tiring him out sooner. Daniel better be okay. That's a coyote. Feels like I haven't seen him in years. Of course I miss everything about him. Even his whining. Yeah, you can't wait to get out on your own. Now you are. And it sucks. Oh, you found the coyote's den. Bed floor. Hello, fellow traveler. Hello, fellow traveler. Daniel might dig this. The billboards is like legitly all you see too, and it's always casinos. Even the restaurants around there all have uh, billboards and stuff for their gambling inside. I will say some of the best uh, buffets I ever ate have been there. This place is freaking me out. Because most places you go is a buffet. They have a. Uh, the Stratosphere Tower. About $100 a plate per person to go up there. Gorgeous views. Don't worry about your feet. It looks just like the Space Needle. Just pace yourself. Oh, shit, there's a truck coming. You gonna ask for a ride? Is she honking at me? He's stopping. Uh, okay, uh... Be cool. Just uh, see what he wants. He wants the trucker special. Remember, kids, if you ever hitchhike, you get in a trucker's truck, they'll give you a ride. They want a little something in return. Just be prepared for that. Truckers can't be cops. Right? We're trying. It's not allowing me to walk any faster. John's dying. 
Hey, need a lift? It's too damn hot to be walking. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, get in. You're gonna die in the desert yeah. otherwise. Thanks. Hold up. Jesus. I like that billboard. First non-gambling one on there. Firstly, I'm not a gambler. I don't like to. Ah, Choco Crisp and Coca-Cola. Propane. Dude, you should fix your eye while you're sitting there. Jeez. What the hell happened to you? I ran into a couple of assholes who beat me up for no reason. Uh, I see. Happens a lot around here. Hey, Anton. You there? Everything all right? Yeah, what's up? GPS tells me you parked in the middle of nowhere. Just wanted to know what happened. I, uh, I had to make a shit stop. Over. <laughs> Too much information, but 10 4. <laughs> you asked. I mean, number two. <laughs> you owe me a beer for that. Over and out. Don't freak out. I, I wouldn't have picked you up if I had cared about that hitchhiking law. <laughs> okay. Cool. So, nice. hungry or what? You look hungry. He looks like he's dying. <sighs> I am. Thank you. As you heard, my name's Anton. Mm. It is good, huh? My wife packs the best sandwiches. <laughs> Messy. Best sandwich ever. Got that trucker special coming. Rock meat sandwich. Anton. Anton. Right. What's your destination? Hmm. Haven Point. You've heard of it? Oh, yeah. Straight ahead, about an hour. Just where he's going. He's being tracked, and if he stops for 30 seconds, they're calling him, so. I love the little cactus up there. I have a bunch of cactuses. They grow natively on my land, so. Take a nap if you want. You don't have to stay awake to be nice. Hey, don't worry, kid. I would not I'm take not a nap. A fucking weirdo. It's always questionable when somebody says they're not a weirdo. Boring trucker. You really should not fall asleep. You should take care of your eye. Man, he makes some questionable decisions. I would agree to get into the truck. Because he was going to die in the desert. But he should have totally not fell asleep. Thank you so much. You just be careful out here. These people are kind of weird. Really? Okay. 10 4, good buddy. Hop out, grab your shit. Hopefully you didn't have to do more than you needed to.
Hey, he left you out of church. Haven Point. Life is a gamble. Bet on the Lord. I knew it. Daniel brought Jake back to uh, his faith. So. Wow. He has risen happy Easter. I forgot about Easter. I completely lost track of time. For sure. Clearly. Universal Uprising Church. Hope those people are caring Christians. Like our grandparents. Alright. We're going to call it here at the church. And uh, we'll pick it up on the next episode. So please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Tell me what you think in the comment section down below. And uh, see you guys in the next episode. Tell me what you think about us traveling the desert, getting our ass beat, and refusing to cooperate with the racist. Well, see you guys later.